Yo, these three things, these three things cannot, I repeat, cannot be in 2K21 at all. They can't be in 2K21 or the game will be ruined. Number one, the overall server-based online experience. That means lagging. That means uh, people getting on your, people are able to walk on your court while you're playing. That means people kicking you off of a spot. All of that. The online, the whole online experience. I'm going to group that all into one. That got to be improved. The technical aspect of it. That has to be improved. I, it cannot be super laggy anymore. You cannot be like, oh, I'm on East and West servers. It cannot be like that. It cannot be people coming on my court. It can't, you can't do that. Also, what I'll lump into that one thing also is we have to find a better way to get people into games quicker when they're playing with randoms. Because sometimes there's a 20, 30 minute wait that's unacceptable, 2K. We have to figure out something better to do with that. We have to. Two. I said three, didn't I? Well, if, in case I didn't say three, I'm doing three. Fuck you. Okay. Two. The layups. The layups. No, 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 no. I'm sorry. No, 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 no. Two, which is the number one gameplay issue. The number one gameplay issue that cannot be in NBA 2K21 is the effectiveness of the Intimidator badge. It is broken. The Intimidator badge is broken. Once you have that badge, weight doesn't matter anymore. Height doesn't matter anymore. Attribute doesn't matter anymore. Yo, how good you can test doesn't matter anymore. That badge has literally broken layups and a lot of other aspects have been badly damaged because of that. So that needs to be fixed. That definitely needs to be fixed. Because and, and also if any and also the badge system needs to be reworked from this perspective. We have centers and I just spoke to somebody in the comments about this. And he said, well, you know, it's a video game. I said, and I'm thinking in my head, well, if you feel like that, then you might as well put demigods back in the game. I just want it to be some balance in the game. That's it. That's it. So that'll probably be another thing, a third thing is balance. Let's rework the my player system to add balance to it. Because it makes no sense that I can have a 16, 611, uh, Rebound and lockdown with gold. I mean with, with Hall of Fame shooting badges, but I can't go from 6-3 to 6-4 without my three-pointer going down. Two, three. That makes no sense. That's absolutely backwards. It shouldn't be like that. If they if they can get if they can get a, a Hall of Fame shooting badges, my three shouldn't go down just because I grow one inch from 6-3 to 6-4. Come on, 2K. Come on, man. So that whole thing needs to be reworked. So you got the servers, you got the servers, you got the uh, Intimidator badge, and then you got the uh, the my player system that needs to be reworked. I'm gonna keep going. Matter of fact, I'm gonna keep going. These, I'm gonna keep going with other things that cannot be in 2K21. Okay. Let's go over to my team. Let's go over to my team. You have to, in 2K21, it has to be easier to get cards. Because Madden is greedy. Madden makes a lot of money in microtransactions. But it's easy to get cards in the game. It's easy. It's, it's, it's very easy. And I'm really not understanding why it's so difficult to get cards in 2K. Y'all are not that greedy. Like, come on. Make it easier. Give us more challenges. Give us higher paying challenges. All that. It needs to be easier to do that. It needs to be. The My Career Story. It has to actually be 
an engaging story. A boring my career story cannot be in 2K21, especially since this is gonna be a next gen experience. It can't be. Once again, a boring my a boring my career experience cannot be in NBA 2K21. It can't. It cannot. I, I'm gonna end up breaking down this whole shit. Yeah, it can't. Because you have all this space, you have a lot of, it's time to get innovative. It's really time to get innovative. It really is. Also, no, I don't even want to fucking go to Jack in the Crack, bro. Also, my GM. I like my GM. I like all the stuff that's in my GM. But truth be told, it's been there for a while. It has been there for a while. So let's add some new aspects to my GM and my league. I know, I know that you pretty much already can do any and everything, but let's let's add some more things to to uh to my GM. Oh, and if you made it this far, the number one thing that can't be in this fucking game is the same park we had in 2K20. And 19. And 18. No. It cannot be the same part. That should have been number one. It can't be. That should have been number one. It cannot be the same parks. It can't. That's unacceptable. Y'all can do better than that. Y'all can do better than that. Let me know in the comments. There's some things. I know it's a lot of things wrong, but I wanted to make this video because I want to hear from y'all. What are the things that you feel like can absolutely not be in NBA 2K21? These are just a few things that I've said that can't be in there. Not things that need to be fixed. There's a lot of things. Let me explain the difference. I'm, there are things that need to be fixed, but that are maybe tolerable. I'm talking about things that absolutely cannot, that are a deal breaker for you. Like if this is in 2K21, I'm not playing it. I'm not buying, I'm not doing nothing. Those things that I mentioned for me, if those are still in the game, it's going to be very hard for me to pick the game back up. I, will go on, I am going to be picking the game back up solely for content creation. And I don't want to do that because that means I'm not going to be having fun. So I know it's a lot more things. Tell me something. One thing out of everything that you feel like is wrong. One thing that you cannot, cannot at all tolerate being in 2K21. All right, y'all. Uh, like and subscribe. Um, I know some of y'all might have seen the test streams that I put up. So yeah, I'm gonna start streaming this shit pretty soon. But um, uh, let me know what y'all think. And uh, I'll see y'all later.